Hi Cancer, welcome to your singles new love read. Thanks for joining me. My name is Michelle. This is for Sun, Moon, Rising and Venus signs. It's for my singles or my curiosity seekers out there. So welcome Cancer. Let's see who's coming in for you guys for the time period of May, June, July 2023. Who's coming in for my Cancers spirit? Cancer's next love or next lover. Please show me Cancer's next lover. Who is this person? Spirit, who is this person that's coming in for the water sign of Cancer? I'm going to take both of those. Let's get some traditional tarot down. I want to see how you'll see this person. How will Cancer see this person? when they first come in I'm going to take both of those how will they see you how will they see cancer and what is the potential outcome between these two spirit are you ready for the big reveal let's do it oh diving in the hanged man okay Pisces energy the Lovers, Gemini Energy, and the Chariot, Cancer Energy. Okay. Oh, you've been waiting a while for this, haven't you? Seems like you've been, either you've been watching this person, they're around you, I get like lurking. They've been around you, you've been around them, but you've been waiting, or they've been waiting. I feel it's you, but it, it could be the other way around. To, to, to take uh, action towards this, this person who uh, you are very attracted to. Now, some of you Cancers have had uh, choices, other choices. Some of you haven't been ready to settle down. Now, you've been dating, casually dating. And uh, you've had this person kind of, I want to say they've been around you maybe in a friend capacity and you see this person has a lot of potential but you haven't moved towards them because you haven't been ready because I think once you do commit I mean you you really commit cancer you do so you haven't been ready you've been waiting you've been waiting 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 and you may have even been waiting for for this person to become free you know perhaps they were casually dating it could have been the opposite way around perhaps they were the one that was uh, wasn't finished dating around let's see how you'll see them king of cups in reverse and the knight of cups these came out together yeah i think that you feel something towards them but you're not ready to express how you feel uh, towards them you're holding back how they will see you mm, the page of cups yeah potential for love here guys a lot of potential this person may be slightly younger than you or vice versa and the outcome between the two of you is the lovers in reverse yeah there's a lot of potential here but it doesn't seem to be i think it's either you or them that are keeping keeping distance between the two of you here cancer now why it seems like you're into this person it does but uh, but you're keeping you're keeping them at arm's length it could be for some of you cancers you're involved with somebody else uh, I'm also getting a small message here this won't be for everyone but you fear that they may not be as welcoming about something about a secret that you have um, for some of you cancers you may uh, be bisexual now that won't be for everyone but for some of you you may uh, uh, swing both ways okay you may fear this person will be hesitant to, uh, to to be more physically involved with you because of that so I feel that uh, that you're very attracted you're very into this person you may even love them or well, beginning the first stirrings of love it's someone that you haven't already been with i feel that this is this is not an ex or it's not someone new either it's just someone that's been around you you haven't been lovers with them yet uh, you may have even been dabbling with with other people 
Okay. Uh, cancer. Let's see. What else do you need to know about this person coming in? Take what resonates, guys. Leave the rest. Uh, but I would say... I would say that... It... Yeah, you've been. Well, I feel like a lot of you cancers. It may not be the bisexual thing. It could be some other kind of secret, uh, something that perhaps. Um, yeah, it, it, it's something there. Something, something that you fear this person finding out. You may think that this person is quite pure or innocent, uh, as compared to you. Or again, can be vice versa. If you're cross watching, guys, this could be a cancer that you're dealing with. Let's see, what does Cancer need to know about their person that's coming in? This new person for Cancer. Strong Earth. Okay. Yeah, you, th you think that they may be a little bit too rigid for you, um, that uh, they may be a little bit too... You, you, I mean, you like that about this person. You like their... You, you like that they seem to be quite together. Uh, but what you don't like about it is that you think that, well, you know, they're not going to be welcoming. They're not going to be accepting of me. This person's too rigid. Okay. What else does Cancer need to know about this person that's coming in for them? Could be a Taurus. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, yeah, they, 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 are, they are a very uh, rigid person. I get stand-up person, uh, loyal, uh, kind, um, very, very attractive. This is someone who you can rely upon, and you like all that about this person, Cancer. But you're thinking, gosh, the will they, will they accept me and my lifestyle, and whatever that may be, guys? Because there's something here where you think that this person won't fit in with your life your lifestyle, you feel that possibly there's incompatibility here, so there's hesitance for you to uh, to approach this person, but you, you're into them. It's like opposites attract kind of energy that I'm picking up between the two of you, Cancer. They may uh, have Virgo or you do in your chart. Now, interestingly enough, if, if my Cancers here, some of you may find that your earth energy wherever you have an earth placement is the thing that that's attracting you you may think well why am i attracted to this person they're so different to what i would normally go for and, and i don't think they're going to be that into me why am i thinking this way well it's because you have an earth placement my spirit guide is saying so look at where you have an earth placement in your chart or a strong, it could even be a north node or a, a Venusian energy or maybe even a rising sign or moon sign. Where is there an earth energy in your chart? Because I think that's the thing that, that uh, you feel this person can, well I'm getting the term rooted now <laughs> for my Australians out there. <laughs> Rooting is quite a different thing, <laughs> lovers. <laughs> but for my for my other, people in the other part of the world, you, you know what I mean. Deeply rooted, stable. You feel that this person can offer you some security, and I think that that's why you why you want to go towards this person. But it's not just that. I, I feel that you do have an emotional feeling for this, but there's just this part of you, and it's intrinsically part of who you are. That you feel this person will be unaccepting of now let's have a look at this person's characteristics cancer to do this deck in two parts so bear with me what are the personality characteristics of the person that uh, is coming in here for cancer okay you see this person as someone who is quite a traditional sort I feel that this person's been quite generous to you. They may have offered to, uh, they may have may offer to cook for you, uh, or they may be the or the one that has put more effort in with that page of cups. Um, they may have been the one here that uh, uh, asked you out. Hmm. Okay. 
Let's see, any other personality characteristics of this person? Now Virgo energy is of course associated with service. Um, so it may be that, uh, that this person stirs up domesticity uh, in some of you. Uh, more of a domestic thoughts of domesticity. Uh, you know, you've had thoughts about settling down, maybe uh, uh, committing to this person. Uh, this person brings up uh, energies of moving in together. Personality characteristics of this person that's coming in for Cancer Spirit. Who is this person? And we've got Student of Life here. Well, Spirit is saying be open to to the possibilities that uh, that um, this person could teach you something, and and likewise, you know, um, because Cancer, it seems that you may have a little bit, perhaps a little bit more experience uh, in, than this person. They they do seem to be coming across as quite uh, innocent or pure here. So you've got something that you could teach this person. <laughs> Hopefully, it's good. <laughs> I really hope it is. Uh, cancer, let's see, what does this person look like? Now some of this will be you, some of it will be them. You'll know which is which of course. What does this person look like that's coming in for Cancer? Cancer's next lover. Uh, someone's quite tall so there's a height difference. I'm picking that up. Yeah, tall and short. There's a height difference. What does this person look like? Cancer's next lover. Someone has blue eyes. Someone could come from Asia or be um, likes Asian culture, likes Asian food. Uh, they may have a statuary that is Asian. They may follow an Asian religion, uh, Buddhism, um, that kind of thing. Yeah, I get this person's quite worldly. They may have traveled. Cancer. Cancer's next lover. Practitioner. Now that could be in anything. Could be a practitioner of the arts. Could be a medical practitioner. Uh, someone here has recently grown some facial hair. Okay. And someone here could be Australian. Doesn't have to be. Uh, but uh, I have a lot of Australian viewers. So for my Australians out there. And someone has some cute little freckles. There's something here where you find this person to be quite cute. Uh, as opposed to you here, Cancer, who is quite... Uh, <laughs> you see yourself as, as the opposite of cute. <laughs> um, yeah, or well, vice versa, you know, take this as it resonates. It can be the other way around. Uh, how else will you recognize this person when they come in? <coughs> How else will my Cancers recognize this person? Your paths will cross when a holiday is in season. You may meet uh, during holiday time. Uh, May, June, July could be, of course, July 4th. Uh, could be, uh, what do we have? We've got May Day there. Uh, gosh, what is it? Uh, it's uh, Memorial Day. Um, forgive me, I don't know everyone's, uh, wherever you are in the world, What? It could even be like a holiday as in you're on vacation. There may be talks of going on vacation, having a holiday together. Uh, someone here has three siblings. Someone wears more than two rings frequently. Now when I get this, it, it may someone may have been married before. They may have even been married twice for some. Could be you, could be the other person. And music will be playing when they ask you out, or, or they, or you could ask them out to a music event. Music seems to be important. Perhaps you've attended a music, or you will be attending a music event with them. And your paths will cross again, again. Interesting that I said again. Yeah, because I think that you you, you know this person during the next air sign season. So what is that? That's Gemini, May. May, June, yeah, okay, May, June, what else do you need to know about this person, Cancer? Short term, it may be, it may be a short term thing, 
or it's a thing that, that comes and goes it's an in and out kind of energy I mean not not in that way but yeah it, it's it's like um, it's, it's interesting because there's this long wait and then we've got this short energy so it may be something that that you've long waited for but then initial but then it then it's quite short I mean take gosh take that as it resonates guys I'm getting all kinds of uh, messages there all right one more message here for cancer when it comes to this new this person that's coming in for them for cancer please what does cancer need to know about this connection what does cancer need to know about this connection that's coming in for them Oh, jealousy involved. Oh, gosh. Okay. All right. Yeah. There, there does seem to have been some kind of... I was picking that up before where it's like on both sides. It may be that you were involved, but it also may be that this person's also got other people. There, there does seem to be a... I think you you met here while well, you've been dating other people they've been dating other people and there's some jealousy uh, surrounding who they're hooking up with or vice versa you know this person could uh, could invoke jealousy in you about who they're hooking up with too because I think you'll meet when you're both um, dating other people I'm going to leave it there for you, Cancer, and wish you all the very best. If you'd like a personal reading in a style like this, please do contact me, gypsyinsights at gmail.com, or you can go to my Etsy store. The link is down below and purchase directly there. Cancer, don't forget to press that thumbs up button before you go. Share me on your social media, and if you're a newcomer, I would love to have you subscribe. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much for your likes, shares, and subscribes, and bye for now.